Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I will be discussing link tools. Link tools are used in production to help minimize any wasted resources by identifying and eliminating waste. Waste is essentially anything that does not add any value to your good or service. Link tools and techniques are used in production and in an organization to help with efficiency. There is a lot of unrecognized waste in production throughout organizations and with the help of lean tools, money, time, and energy, and so much more can be saved. So in one of my engineering courses, I was asked to create a five to 10 minute video describing and demonstrating the application of lean tools to my everyday life and show how this could eliminate waste in my routine. Uh, there are several lean tools, I think there are about like eight of them, but for this assignment, I was asked to use three specific ones and they were the 5S, SMED, and Kanban. So continue watching and I will show you how I use lean tools to improve my life. So the first lean tool that I will be discussing is 5S. It's used in the workplace to eliminate any wasted motion and it also helps with improving utilization. I listed the 5S's uh, which I will be using to evaluate my daily life example. I chose 5S as the lean tool that I was going to use to evaluate how I wash my face. I noticed that I was wasting a lot of time looking for different things to use to wash my face every morning. The time and energy used looking for products around my restroom could have been used to study more for an exam. I kept a checklist for two weeks. The previous week, I wasn't able to wash my face every day before I implemented these, uh, my lean tool. To eliminate any wasted time, I sorted and straightened out my products. I put them in a bag and kept it on my countertop. I also shined and cleaned my countertop. So I noticed that when I was not keeping it with my workspace, keeping it clean, and also the fact that my products were all over my restroom, it didn't allow me to wash my face daily. Doing this will allow me to continue to wash my face daily without wasting time. Washing my face every morning helps me to wake up in the morning so that I'll be able to go to class and make the grades that I need to. Also, it helps prevent breakouts and just keep me feeling fresh and beautiful. Implementing 5S to my daily wash face, face wash routine helped me to also eliminate any unnecessary motion because I was able to have my products arranged on my countertop. So the following week when I implemented my lean tool, the 5S, I was able to wash my face every day. I could still improve my time by putting my stuff back in my bag immediately after using them. The next lean tool that I will be discussing is SMED. It stands for Single Minute Exchange of Dye or Dyes. And the primary focus of this lean tool is to remove any, eliminate any wasted time. The key components to a SMED analysis will be the setup elements, changeover, and any tool changes. I chose the method of SMED to evaluate this part of my life because I see this as killing two birds with one stone. I chose this tool because I was faced with the challenge of being able to whiten my teeth and do my hair before going to class. To set up, I allowed my whitening treatment to sit on my teeth for 10 minutes. 
The Smed Lean tool allows me to have more time to eat breakfast in the morning so that I can get out the house earlier. Leaving the house earlier will allow me to be able to ride the bus in the morning so I could save my gas and not pollute the air and save some money to use towards other things like bills. In the previous week, I did them separately and I noticed that I was wasting a lot of time. I was standing around. I was just all over the place and I was just noticing that this time could be put elsewhere. The following week, I decided to first put in my whitening strips and then uh, while the timer was going, I could be flat ironing my hair while waiting on my teeth to whiten. I used a stopwatch to record my time last week and this week, and I compared the two. In the second week, I was able to remove 7 minutes and 20 seconds from my time. The SMED tool helped my time a lot, but I noticed that I was still able to dance and do other non-productive things that didn't add any value. So I could possibly add something else to this routine to help utilize that wasted time. Lastly, I would like to discuss Kanban. Kanban helps you to visualize your work, reduce work in progress, and maximize efficiency. I bring my planner with me everywhere I go to keep up and to write down any events or assignments that I need to do. I usually transfer my activities that I recorded in my planner to my wall calendar. The problem that I was faced with was that sometimes I would forget to look at my wall calendar or my planner. To fix this issue, I started using the Time Tree app. The Time Tree app helped me to better manage my activities for the day. The Time Tree app also allows me to set up alerts of events or assignments coming up. I have also found it useful for sharing with classmates, friends, significant others, employers. I used this tool to upgrade the way I was planning my days. My next step in addressing the problem would be to allow the app to notify me at least a week in advance for each of my activities. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions about lean tools or anything, honestly, you can message me. You can hit me up on Instagram. I answer those. You can also send me a message on Snapchat. And if you're not already, go ahead and follow me on those platforms. Yeah, so don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, check the description box for more details. And until next time, bye.